<laughs> so what's your name? Sylvia. Sylvia? Yeah. Right, Sylvia, what needs fixing? Um, well, I've got a lot of pain all over, but my hip and my back and my middle back are chronic arthritis. Right, let's do the hip first. <coughs> yeah. I'm going to work on that hip. Yeah. Right. All right, now let's have a think about what arthritis is. If I tell you my name is Jeanette, what does it tell you about me? Female, European maybe, that's it. But it doesn't tell you anything about me. When a doctor gives a set of symptoms a name, arthritis, it's like a, a shorthand between doctors and between the general public now, so we sort of know aches and pain, pains in joints, maybe worse in cold or damp, yeah? All right. But arthritis isn't a thing. I can't give you a cup of arthritis like I could give you a cup of sugar or a cup of milk, can I? Arthritis isn't a thing, yeah? A chair's a thing, but arthritis isn't a thing. Pain is real. Uh, creaking joints is real. <coughs> Swelling is real. Inflammation is real. Arthritis <coughs> is not a thing. All right. I'm going to go one stage further now and say cancer is not a thing. Your cells multiply faster. Uh, blood tumor, uh, when, when a tumor grows in a body, the, the cancer grows its own blood supply. Did you know that? That's, that's how tumors develop. It's got its own separate blood supply. <laughs> Arthritis is not a thing. Cancer is not a thing. Rheumatoid arthritis is not a thing. Lupus is not a thing. They're all just labels given for a set of symptoms. Now, if things are things, like if cancer is not a thing, if arthritis is not a thing, how could you ever find a cure for something that's not a thing? It's not a thing. <coughs> yeah, and so a lot of our charities are going down the wrong path. And the only path they're going down is pharmaceutical drugs, pharmaceutical drugs, pharmaceutical drugs. And it's like, no, there are other, you, you, what you want to do is you want to find the cause of the swelling or the cause of the inflammation or the cause of the aching and address it. So it's not about curing, it's about removing the underlying cause. And that is what these surgeons do. Now, would it be fair to say that in your life you're a little bit of a perfectionist? You like things just so. She does. If she cooks a meal, it's all laid out nice on the plate, I'll just slop it on there. And I bet your house is pretty tidy too, isn't it? Fairly tidy. Mine's a complete not a mess. My house being a mess is one of my greatest gifts to all my girlfriends. Because when they come round my house, I can see them and they're like, oh my God, this is a pigsty. Oh my God, my, my house is better than this. And they feel really quite cool. Yeah? So arthritis is not a thing. Arthritis is not a thing. Inflammation is a thing. Aching is a thing. What does it mean? There's too much energy there. That's what's making the heat. E now walk around a little bit, just see how it's all feeling. I've worked on your back and your head. Back seems not there. Yeah. Hips, but hips still hips still hurting? Mm. Yeah, mm -hmm. cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, cool. Right. God bless. So what the surgeon does, because I've observed him working through me, the different ones over the years, they never try and fix you. There's no attempt to fix. All they do is they bring their conscious awareness in and they sort of scan and they feel how you feel and they, it's like, oh, it's a bit like, you know in uh, Star Wars when they talk about like a ripple in the field or that's what they're feeling, they're feeling, oh, there's not enough energy there. But we've just found a little area where there's just not enough energy. And as they bring their higher vibrational energy into your energy field, your, whether we call it your subconscious, whether we call it your higher self, and they are two separate things, um, decides, oh, I like the feel of that energy, I'll have some of that. And your body like sucks in what it needs from these surgeons, and then uses that energy to do what it needs to in your body. Now walk around again, see how the hip and the back feel. That's a bit 
It's moved. Cool. Moving it is good. Yeah, but when the, we need pain to go, it, it very often has to move first. Cool. And now I've got a pair of pincers. So that's showing me. So that's a, like a, a bit of clairvoyance in my head to show me what's helped. And what I'm being shown, it's not quite like pincers. It's like, do you remember when we used to do the washing with the old mango? Mm -hmm. And the <coughs> old washing board? Mm -hmm. oh, yeah? Times have moved on. You see, our grandmothers then thought we were going to have so much time, ladies, when we got that automatic. <laughs> we got less time than they had. They used to have somebody's off. What happened? <laughs> yeah? But I remember to get the hot stuff, because it was all in a boil wash back then, wasn't it? Yeah. They had these wooden things with metal at the top. Mm. Tongs. Mm. Tongs, yeah. 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 And that's what I'm seeing in her hip, is that that's what's holding that hip mm. in. So when they show me things like that, it's just to give me an idea of, um, if you can imagine any being held with tongs for some length of time, you remove the tongs, but there'll still be a little residue of something, it'll still not feel quite right, the energy's still a bit, a bit depressed. As in pressed in, not depressed, blue, that not, not. It's pushed in, pushed in energy. Right, have a walk around again, notice how that feels. Mm -hmm. <coughs> to do a little uh, thing. It's called the Gayatri Mantra and it's designed to cleanse. It's on one of my CDs. Um, I'm not going to sing it like it's on the CD. I'm just using it to clear energy. And This is for everybody in the room. And this is to help you release anything in your energy field that isn't how it should be, that shouldn't be there. So just close your eyes. Make sure your arms and your legs are uncrossed. <coughs> Make sure you keep your eyes closed. I'm going to sing it three times, and it's just going to be to help everybody release whatever needs releasing. Yeah, brilliant. Go. Okay. 